Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Rico, Rick, Ricoa, R I C O A, Ricoa. We're going to go with it. These are all products of the Philippines. We found them at Jungle Gems International Market. They were $2.19 a bag. I have the Curly Tops. It's rich chocolate for chocolate lovers. Curly Tops in pillow wrap is what it says. Yeah, and I have Flat Tops, milk chocolate in a pillow wrap, which is, is the kind of wrapper, I guess. Though. Okay, yeah, I don't know. So, I thought the names were cool. That's why I bought them. Flat Top and Curly Top. I mean, it just sounds like they're talking about hair. Um, so, rich chocolate for chocolate lovers, like I said. Ten servings in the container. Three pieces are 80 calories. And, um, like I said, product of the Philippines. I don't even know. Um, I, I guess it's just, you think it's going to be just pure chocolate through and through? It seems like. They're very, very small. Yeah. Yes, very small. Hmm. That was a different texture than I was expecting. Kind of chalky. Mm-hmm. Yeah, gritty. Mm-hmm. The aftertaste is almost like a, a cookies and cream kind of flavor. Mm hmm. Like that's the flavor you come away with is almost cookie and cream. I actually like it. I do too. <laughs> it's different. It is different. The chalky flavors, I mean, texture is a little weird, but the flavors are bad. It's not like high quality chocolate. No. I'm going to tell you that right now. No, it's not. It's not even a Hershey's. No. Um, it's not up to even Hershey's. But. It does taste like a cheap chocolate. I hate to say that. It tastes like a cheap chocolate, mm -hmm. but what 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 uh, draws you to it, the, where the attraction lies, is the texture of yeah. it because it's so different. Right, right, yeah. It's like a chalky texture. Um, That's but, strange. It, but it is just a solid piece of, of milk chocolate. Yeah. This is rich chocolate, uh, same thing for chocolate lovers. They're called flat tops milk chocolate. Three pieces are 80 calories again. And, um. Might be the exact same thing. It, uh, well, I don't think so, because I, I don't think they would call them by the same. I mean, I, I think they, they would put them under, um. They wouldn't put them under different names if it were the same. It does have the same texture. Mm hmm. And I swear it does taste the same. It tastes exactly the same. Well, why do I call them two different things? Well, one's got the curly decoration and that one has flat decoration. Well, who cares if it's the same chocolate? No, I could see kids getting this at Halloween. <laughs> Don't go to their house, Mom, because they have the cheap chocolate. It's not It's not bad, though. It's, it, it's flavor, you can tell it's very different, cheap, cheaper. If this flavor. were sold here, it would be in the Dollar Tree. Probably. Yeah, it would be, it would be, dull. and that's not to say that everything in the Dollar Tree tastes bad or anything like that, because no, the Dollar sell. Tree has really, really good chocolate, yeah. but this in particular is online with something cheaper that you would find there. Yeah. So. It's not bad, it's just different. No, but it is exactly the same. It tastes the same. It just has a different design on the top. Yeah, absolutely. But it genuinely does have a nice texture and the mm -hmm. texture is where the attraction lies because you have to uh, bite through it and that's what where the fun is. And it comes with this like sandy, pasty kind of texture. Yeah, <laughs> which weird. sounds horrific, but it's actually it it's actually really good. Yeah. So I doubt very many people watching this video have had this before. But if you have, I'd like to hear from you. Why did you know why two different names? If you know um, why, why not just make? The, I mean, it's the same thing. Um, uh, yeah, I'd like to know who's buying the stuff. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.